Minsan pa nating hagan ang ating nakaraan. Hi! Welcome to my channel and this is episode 138 of our Grade Tour of the Famous Series. In this episode, we return to Loyola Memorial Park in Paranaque in search of notable individuals and famous celebrities interred in this part of Metro Manila. Come, join us to remember, celebrate the life, and visit the final resting place of a multi-awarded veteran film director for more than 30 years since 1980. Located at the southern side of the park at the Savior Family Estate section, we found the Diaz Mausoleum and the final resting place of film director Marilu Diaz Abaya. Marilu Correa Diaz was born in March 1955 in Quezon City. She was a multi-awarded film director and managed many film projects for more than 30 years. She is best remembered for her multi-awarded masterpiece movies such as the 1998 Jose Rizal and 1999 Muro Ami. Diaz Abaya had 23 film and TV credits as director, 2 as writer, 2 as actress, and 8 as producer from 1982-2012. Her film debut as director was the 1980 movie Tanikalai starring Susan Rosas. Romeo Vasquez, Eddie Garcia, and Rita Gomez. Her other film projects as director include 1980 Brutal starring Ami Austria, Gina Alahar, Charo Santos, and Jay Ilaga, where she won the Best Director Award at 1980 MMFF and nominated for Best Director in the 1981 FAMAS and Durian Awards. Diaz Abaya studied film in Los Angeles and London and began directing in 1979. Her second film, Brutal, was an angry study of the sufferings of a Filipino wife. The majority of Filipino women are disposed to accept um, abuse, to accept personal and social injustices. They're predisposed to being, if you like, martyrs. 1982 Moral, starring Lorna Tolentino, Gina Alahar, Sandy Andolong, and Anna Marine, where she was nominated for Best Director in the 1983 FAMAS and Gawad Urian Awards. Her fifth film, Morale, took these concerns further. It centers on four women friends and compares their experiences of men, marriage and work. At first I wanted to do a film about female friendship, how and why they bond. Uh, how they react to each other, what is female friendship like as compared to male friendship, and in what context do we see female friendship. We went further by discussing not only female friendship, but uh, the social context in which we can find it, such as the Filipino family, the institutions surrounding it, such as the educational institutions and the church institutions, and, and so on. And um, we came out with morale. Largely today, uh, it's perfectly all right for the Filipino woman to hold government offices or uh, to be the president of banks and very big corporations. But uh, you see, with the provision that they do not neglect uh, family, husband, children, and so forth and so on. And I feel that perhaps this in itself, this expectation may not be necessarily fair, uh, that women ought to have the, the, the real option uh, of whether they want to be a full-time housewife, a full-time career woman, or both. 1983, minsan pa nating hagka ng ating nakaraan starring Vilma Santos, Christopher De Leon, and Eddie Garcia. Probably the youngest architect in town. 
Mr. Ocampo, my wife, Helen. Pleased to meet you, Mrs. Aurelio. Hindi ko intindihan. Ano sa bakit mo ko ginaganito? Hindi ba niya ito? Paragraph. Kinukumpormiso. Wala akong consideration. 1983 Carnal starring Charito Solis, Philip Salvador, Vic Silayan, Joel Torre, and Cecil Castillo. Where she was nominated for Best Director in the 1984 Gawad Urian and won the Best Director in the 1984 FAMAS and Film Academy of the Philippine Awards. Sing, nakamukhang kamukha mo ang kanyang ina. Mahal na mahal ng kuya ang inay. Parang meron silang tatlong isang maliit na daigdig. Huwag kang masyado maglalalapit sa mga taga rito. Kalit sila sa amin. Ang gaslaw-gaslaw naman ang babaeng yan. Parang si Elena. Yung asawa mo, kailangan pantayan mo. Paano namatay ang inay niyo? Sigurado ka bang pipitbing yan? Sabarin mo lawin, isang akmang mukpat, nasa'y piyano ka na. 1984, Baby Tina is starring Vilma Santos with Philip Salvador and Tindo Fernando, where she was nominated for Best Director Award in the 1985 Gawad Urian. 1987, Six O'Clock News, a comedy gag show as aired over IBC 13 starring Jaime Fabregas, Cesc Quesada, and René Requestas. In 1993, kung ako iiwan mo starring Lorna Tolentino and Gabby Concepcion with Edu Manzana and Salsa Fadilla. 1995, ipaglaban mo the movie starring Charmaine Arnaiz and Chin Chin Gutierrez where she was nominated the Best Director in the 1996 Film Academy of the Philippines and Gawad Urean Awards. 1996, may nagmamahal sa'yo starring Lorna Tolentino with Ariel Rivera where she was nominated for Best Director Award in the 1997 FAMAS. 1997, Milagro starring Charmaine Arnaiz, where she won the Best Director in the 1998 Gawad Urian Awards. 1998, Sa Puso ng Dagat starring Jomari Iliana with Elizabeth Oropesa and Chin Chin Gutierrez, where she was nominated for Best Director in the 1999 Gawad Urian Award and winner of Ogen's Favorite Choice Award at 1999 CineQuest San Jose Film Festival. 1998, Jose Rizal starring Cesar Montano, where she won the Best Director Awards in the 1998 MFFF, 1999 FAMAS, and 1999 Star Awards for Movies. 1999, Muro Ami starring Cesar Montano, where she was nominated for Best Director in Year 2000 Film Academy of the Philippines and Gawad Urian Awards, and won the Best Director Awards in the 1999 MMFF and the Year 2000 FAMAS. <laughs> natin maabot ang kota, agad hindi tayo mag-iiba na ruta. Kung hindi mo ibebenta agad ang mga isda, mapupuno na natin ang tatlong daang banyera. Limang daang banyera ta. Pero napakahirap ng panahon ngayon. Kailangan magkaroon tayo ng konting ambisyon. Alam mo ba ang sinasabi mo? Mga pamilya din ang mga yan. Kaya nga eh. Dagdag kita ito para sa kanila. Baka ba sila ipahamak mo? 2001 Bagong Buwan, starring Cesar Montano where she won the Best Director Award in the 2002 FAMAS. 2003, noon at ngayon saring Dina Vonnebe, Cherry Pie Picache, Jean Garcia, and Yula Valdez, where she was nominated for Best Director Award in 2004 FAMAS. 
2005, maging akin muli starring Marvin Agustin, Noel Trinidad, and Sandy Andulong. Her last project was the 2011 film Ikaw ang Pag-ibig starring Marvin Agustin, Jomari Eliana, and Ina Feleo, where she was nominated for Best Director in the 2012 Golden Screen Awards. Doon, mas malapit ka sa pagmamahal ng Diyos. Last award-winning director, Marilu Diaz Abaya. Eddie Garcia, Noni Buen Camino, Shamaine Centenera, Marvin Agustin, Jomari Iliana, at Ina Feleo. Diaz Abaya also appeared in couple of films in cameo roles in the 1984 Working Girls is starring Hilda Coronel, Rio Luxin, Chanda Romero, and Carmen Martin. And 1985, Hinugot sa Langit starring Maricel Soriano with Charito Solis, Dante Rivero, Altantay, Ami Austria, and Ruel Santiago. Ms. Velasquez, good afternoon. Ms. Castro, come in. Have a seat, please. Congratulations. You're hired. Ang appointment letter mo? Thank you. You know that that's government regulated. After six months, if your performance is good, pwede ka na maging permanente. After six months, pwede ka mag-SL. Sick leave, 15 days. If you get pregnant, pwede ka mag-ML. Oh, when can you start? Monday? Yes, ma'am. Good. Dia Sabay was initially diagnosed with breast cancer in 2007. She lost her five years battle and died in October 2012 at the age of 57. In the next episodes, we will post the video of our recent visit of Manila North Cemetery and Libingan ng mga bayan in Taguig. Later in this channel, we will also post more grade two videos including Manila Memorial Park in Paranaque and Loyola Memorial Park in Marikina. Thanks for watching. Please do subscribe if you like my channel. See you in our next grade tour of the famous episodes.